and welcome to this week's upload. Who dis? I had my hair cut guys. I had my hair cut. There will still be a few videos that are coming up with long hair and then it goes short and you'll be like, what's going on? But I've had my hair cut um, and I think this is the first video you will have seen my hair cut in. So there we go, had it all chopped off. Da, da, da. Anyway, today is an exciting day because today and tomorrow I'm filming a really fun video that's going to end up with a haul at the end, which I know loads of you really love. And I'm working with a brand that's one of my faves. One of my faves that I mention on Instagram loads and loads of times. We've never worked with each other before, and it is Matalan. And today I am going to the new Matalan store in Leicester. Let me know if any of you live in Leicester or near Leicester um, to go and have a little look around, to go and make an edit, which I've never done before. So an edit is where you pick some favourite outfits and put outfits together. And I'm taking my mum because, fun fact about my mum, there is not a week, it's really making me smile, there's not a week where my mum doesn't pop into Matalan. Sometimes more than once. And if there's a Matalan sale on, woo -hoo -hoo. So I was like, Mom, I'm working with Matalan, do you want to come? She's like, yes. So Nanny San's coming along with me as well, which is really, really, really funny. Um, I love Matalan because it's really reasonably priced. Yesterday, I actually went onto their site and they um, let me have a little look around and pick out some outfits to wear. So hopefully, fingers crossed if they've arrived, I'll be wearing some Matalan uh, later on in the video and tomorrow. This is an old Matalan outfit that I had myself, which I absolutely love. It's great for frocks. It's great for kids wear. They did mention I could do, pick up some homeware. So I'm hoping they've got some autumn homeware. And do you know what? If autumn homeware is not part of the stuff I can pick, I'm just gonna buy me some. I want a pillow with the squirrel on. And they often do stuff like that. So come along for the adventure and don't forget at the end is the haul. Um, so it should be like a really super fun video. Right, I've got to go and drop the little kiddlywinks off at school pick mother up and then we're, we're road tripping it so uh, see you in a bit hello we have made it to leicester i shall link below in the description box where the new shop is it's a haymarket shopping center isn't it That's and we're at the new store and it is empty it doesn't open till tomorrow um at the moment it's just people like kind of putting stock on the shelves but i thought i'd give you a little shop tour a nice empty shop tour so as you walk in there is a ginormous children's section so we will start over here which is like the little kiddos and immediately i am in love with look at that i'm happy that's four quid that's adorable that's adorable ethan had something similar like that last year didn't he gold just like an alternative to a christmas jumper we've got little boots um we've got kind of nightwear and stuff over here a little bit older wear we regularly get the old tracky bees from here. Oh, I can already see something with poo emojis on, which Ethan would love, wouldn't he? Yeah. A week in the life of a poo? Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's beautiful. Isn't that a great coat? Yeah. 27. Mum's like, yeah. So, over here is kind of like the school uniform and little boots. And we all walk past these and we're like, oh, guys, look at them. I wish Eric, Mama said, have another baby <laughs> just to wear pom pom boots. <laughs> and also, look at these, look at them. Oh, okay, we've got little girls kind of stuff, younger girls. This, I would wear. Could you not see me rocking that on the schoolroom? With the boots and the woolly tights. Cute little jumpers. Over here is kind of the 9 to 16 range, so. Again, I would like to wear that <laughs> as well. Do you think Erin will want to twin with me the whole of autumn? Thoughts? Uh, some of the time. Some of the time, yeah. We've got like jeans, obviously sparkly bits and pieces. Love this and I love that as well. Then we've got the nightwear. Oh, I wish we were just in shops by ourselves all the time. And round here, more kiddies stuff. So if you're into that, I did see for the Disney fans, over here, I absolutely love this little Lion King dress. It's beautiful, isn't it, with a bit of Simba on? Lovely. And then baby stuff, which I'm gonna avoid because 
it makes me far too, but oh my gosh, mum, look at that. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Shall I buy it and just put a little, Shall I put Lucy in it? Put the dog in it, I love it. As soon as we walked in, I was like, this is the dress of dreams. So this is the soon range, isn't it, mum, that's kind of aimed at older ladies, but- Middle aged, Middle aged, I'm yeah, telling you what, do. I would wear that. 100% and I'd also I would wear that as well That's I love cool. it I love it yeah you like that I would I like call that. that a wonky top I like it's asymmetric like <gasps> mother's just spotted oh my god look at that that's a good oh that's a good midi skirt yeah, that is beautiful yeah. oh that's cracking that is oh I might have to put that on the old wish list then you've got like a workwear section a lingerie there is a really brilliant men's section at the back. Because guys, we haven't even come to the good women's section downstairs yet. Oh, all the other stuff. So lots of nice stuff here for Stephen. Oh, those boots are nice. They're leather. They're nice. Men's stuff. Stephen loves a polo shirt. It is his favourite item of clothing. So nice little men's. And should we go over to the homeware? Because I know that's what some of you are waiting for. Look at this, I love this little plant. And then also over here, I bet you will love that, look at that. And this is either gonna excite you or enrage you, the Christmas stuff. High five to all my Christmas people out there. Let me know in the comments if you're excited. I already saw, mother, I want that Christmas tree bath mat. <laughs> Do we think Stephen might think I got, I'd lost it. You can have it for your birthday. <laughs> look at that. Oh, I can have one in the kitchen, one in the and one in both bathrooms. I love it. How about this one? Oh, the reindeer on, and they've got all like these are nice, like the Christmas bits and pieces. Oh, look at this for Lucy. <laughs> I'm so excited for Christmas, guys. Let me know if Christmas you're just not thinking about it, or if it's at the forefront of your mind. That's a nice duvet, and that is a lovely duvet. So the upstairs is brilliant, but there's a downstairs. So should we go and have a little look downstairs, mother? Yes, please. Hooray, we're in the women's section, and can we just see all the autumn goodness? Look at all these, these are lovely. The school run, I love them. Also, they have a lot of makeup here. So it's currently on three for two, and me and mother spotted these. We love those. And we've not tried the Matalan makeup, have we? No, I've not. No. So, that's something I want to have a little investigation into. Over here is a brand within Matalan that I actually get quite a lot of stuff from called a Farmer Heritage. And I love this. I love that. That's so nice. This is amazing. And that's a cute t shirt. All mothers found to me. Mum, you love a jumper with a phrase <laughs> on. You love it, don't you? Wild at heart and mustard. <laughs> Colour of the season. And back here, there's like sportswear. And lots of you want to ask what kind of. Where I get my sportswear? I have these Soul Looks. And I also have those. And I have the, um, what are these called? Sports bars. But these leggings are great. I get them in a 18 and sports bras in a large. So the sole looks the back there is like shoes and bags, but people are setting that up, so I don't want to interrupt them. Let's go and have a little look at the front of the shop. This is my section. Look at the dress. I love that dress. I love that dress. I love that dress. There's some, oh, look at this spot. Is this a jumpsuit? Oh, I'm, I'm rocking jumpsuits at the moment. I really like That's them. That's really nice, isn't it? Um, a midi skirt. This dress over here. Oh, look at that. Um, I don't think I've mentioned her here before, but secretly in my head, I think I'm Stevie Nicks and Fleetwood Mac. <laughs> so I love that. Oh, I know, I just saw that like, the midi skirt. Look at it. This is my catchphrase, living my best life, always. Love that, I love that, but I will admit, these do not look nice on me, but on other people, they're just beautiful, aren't they? They just, sometimes we get tums in our family, don't we? We have little tummies, and they're not great for little, for little tums. What's that say? Inspire, that's nice. And then the dress of dreams. 
Oh, oh, oh. Look at that. I love it. Really nice. And then the chunky knit section. And we thought this is a nice one. That's a good one. It's a very uh, good one for the school run. So all in all, this shop's got loads of stuff, hasn't it? The kids stuff, loads. This has got more women's stuff than the one by my house. Look at these trainers. Oh, look at that. Oh, perfect for the school run. Right, the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you something now that's gonna make you laugh and made me and mum go, oh, gasp. They have given me a section in this Matalan here and also one on the stairs styled by Emma Conway and me and mom are going to style some mannequins. I can't wait. <laughs> Mom's like, I can't wait. So we've got two girls here, two women here. We've got two women up there and two men. I just love it. So we're going to style, style some mannequins. <gasps> Ta-da! Edited by Emma Conway. So we have this lovely dress with a mustard bag and these shoes would look ace with black tights. As we know, I can't wear a huge heel. So they're perfect. This is the little kind of, the little bag. And then here is a school mum run outfit, like a school run mum outfit. So we've got puffer jacket. If it's, you know, cold, you need to put your hood up. This jumper of dreams, which I think I showed earlier, but I will show you again here. I love it, I love it so much. And then we've got some jeans. Like, you know, I'd probably wear some sort of jeggings. And then we've got these little pumps, which I love and are perfect for autumn. And for the winter, you could just put boots or I don't know, wellies. And then we put a bit of a rucksack on the back to put your brolly and all sort of whatever baby wipes in. So these are kind of my little edits. I love it, don't you love it, mom? It was so much fun. And then I've done some more over there and I'm gonna go and I'll film those. So they're just, they're just kind of dressing the mannequins, but I just love it. And here's the other ones we did. So we did a little Steven. And this outfit is literally me, is it not? Can we not, can we not see? And then up here, Nanny San model a little outfit because she loves the jumper. This is another Steven here, Cash. And up here we have a mini Ethan and a mini Erin before Erin started refusing to wear pink. So, yay! Hello, and now I'm back in my house. I had such a lovely time with mum in the Matalan shop. It was just amazing to like edit and style my own outfits. I just absolutely adored it. And then on the Saturday, I went back and I handed out like golden ticket vouchers to followers and also, I managed to get a little bit of time with Mark Wright. Now, if you're not from the UK, Mark Wright was on a popular television programme a while back called The Only Way is Essex, which is like a reality TV show. And he pops up on telly ever so often, does presenting. He's kind of one of the face of Matt Lant, and he was so lovely. I shall insert a little clip now. I haven't watched it back. It'll probably just be cringe of me going, because he's very good looking. So I'll insert that now. Right, I am here with... The one and only. The one and only Mark Wright. And I'm gonna show him the clothes. Now you already said you liked my, that's based on my husband there. I do like that. The yeah, the hoodie's based on my husband. I was thinking, I want that outfit. Yeah, you want that hoodie. So now and your husband is uh... Stylish. Yes. I shall, I shall tell him. And then, I, and then my mom came yesterday and she designed the one with the little Mustard jumper on, Nanny yeah. San. Wild as hot. Wild at heart. heart, yeah. Are you wild at heart? My mum certainly is. But yeah, here are all my little clothes. So we are here and we're handing out vouchers and just generally living our best life. Yes, mummy, rummy of two has killed it. This looks amazing. Right, here is the haul portion of the video. So here are some of the autumn picks that I've picked up from Matalan. First of all, I am wearing a t-shirt that says living my best life, because as we know, this is one of my catchphrases. I love the mustard. The t-shirt is um, sewn in, which is really good. I plan to tuck this into um, maybe a leopard print skirt or one of my midi skirts with tights, and I just love it. So. I went in uh, hard on the dresses. You might have seen on Instagram one of the dresses I wore, but here are some of the other ones I picked up. I will leave a link to the Matalan website below so you can, you know, have a look at all of them. But the first dress 
was one of the ones I put on the mannequin, which is longer than midi length. What's longer than, but not to the floor? I don't know what a good in-between word would be, but it's really, really lovely. It comes with a nice underskirt. It's cinching at the waist, which is really, really good for figures like mine. And then it has a little bow there. It's really lovely. This will look fab with black tights and boots or even no tights and boots with little socks in. So I love that little dress. That's beautiful. Then this was from like their curve range. Um, and this is just like a really, look at that, it's like a paisley print. Kind of like a smock dress, which would look great. I mean, how autumn. <gasps> the autumn aesthetic. Like a paisley print, which will look great with black tights and big, like, chunky biker boots. Just, I loved that. And their curve range was was really, really nice. So that's fab your loss. So, um... Another dress. Now, this is the dress that I popped on my Instagram, so to be sure to go and check it out because it doesn't look as good in my hands as it did on my body. So, this is a, another long dress. It, I will say it is quite tight around the waist, this one. And it, again, it comes with um, an underskirt, which is really good. And it's kind of... Um, we've got like animal prints. We've got like a paisley one, it's red, and it just looked really good. In fact, I'll put a picture here of what it looked like, but I absolutely loved that frock as well. You will have seen on one of the mannequins that I styled, I picked up this black shirt. Now this is 14 pounds. Black shirt with like little buttons down. Now it does tie, but I will be definitely will be tucking this into loads of the midi skirts that I already have. I just thought it was really plain. It could be used for anything. You could even use this with, because I've got a few like sparkly midi skirts. I've got sequin ones. I've got like um, kind of a rainbowy sparkly one. So really nice. And it's quite thick actually, it's quite a thick shirt. And I paired this on my mannequin with this lovely midi skirt, which was 20 pound. And this is in the soon range. So it's like animal print, but a Pleated, which is all the things that I love in a um, in a pattern in a skirt. Because for me, autumn is midi skirts. I didn't pick up any chunky knits actually. I didn't pick up any chunky knits, but there's still time because actually it's still quite sunny today. And then the final little frock I picked up was one I actually saw as I was leaving on the Saturday, and I was like. I think I need it in my life. And this one was £16. And this isn't midi length. This is kind of knee length. And let's hold it up. It has got an underskirt in it as well. And this is a lovely pattern as well. It cinches in at the waist and it's like ruched. Ruched at the bottom. And I thought again, lovely with black tights. Can you see, can you see the pattern? Black tights. I do, they, I did have a lovely pair of shoes from Alan, they're doing them again in black and grey, but they didn't have the grey ones, but when I pop it on Instagram, I'll pair it with those black, they're kind of like thick sandals and they're really, really nice, so, loved that as well, I love it, I love it, I love it, a lot of these do come up to the neck with a little bow, I will say, and if you've got bigger boobs, that's not ideal, so usually I just undo a few buttons and kind of flash me bits and pieces so other things I picked up I went for some really nice pleather size six um what are they called Chelsea boots they're called Chelsea boots yeah Chelsea boots which is a really and they've got loads of different types of Matlan and I will say I do have really wide feet and I fitted in these fine and I wore them all day Saturday super comfy no issues so and they can go with all of those outfits that I showed you I also got this little bag here which has got like, um, oh my gosh, I can't, is it metal work? Let me know in the comments. When people, when fancy people talk about their bags, they talk about the zips and stuff. Is it metal work? You lot will know. You know more than me. But I love this. It does literally fit in a phone, <laughs> your cash card, and a lippy. So you're not gonna be doing the school run with this, but you might be able to go on a night out or like an event or something. So that was really cute. And they had loads of cute bags. They had some 
ginormous bags as well. So alongside this t-shirt, I also picked up this one for £12.50, which is from the Farmer Heritage range, which is kind of like a boho chic festival range, which is just like, just like me. Hey guys, I'm off to a festival. I mean, I'm not off to a festival, but, and it says, female intuition. Female intuition, and I, I just thought this was so 70s. And I thought this, with a red lipstick, again, tucked into my um, animal print skirt. Maybe even that um, green one would just be lovely. And I like the fact that it's got turned up sleeves as well, which is always nice. So I loved me that. And then for Erin, I just picked up a little uh, ribbed kind of mustard. Can you see it doesn't look very mustardy on there actually? But it's like mustard and red and gold, a little ribbed top which I really really liked that had loads of kids stuff and let me know if you want me to do a kids autumn haul Stephen and I actually said this morning we need to kind of go through their wardrobes file away the summer stuff and get out the autumn stuff and get some new bits and pieces if you want me to do that let me know I can do kind of like a joint video or individual videos and also obviously the classic uh, pinafore dress which um Erin absolutely loves to wear. She adores a pinafore dress. Who doesn't? Then I popped into the homeware and got, oop, hello. I got this little plant, look at it. Hello. Um, I'd say this will probably end up on um, Erin's, in Erin's shelves. It's very super cute. So that little one there. I also got this for my kitchen probably or maybe my office i don't know i do like a fake succulent um they're just much easier to look after surprisingly enough because you know they don't die so love that as well and then i saw this and i was like i need it in my life i haven't got much christmas stuff at the moment but i thought this in my kitchen not far from my hot chocolate station yes please if you go on the site all the prices will be on the site um i picked up they did you know that my have its own beauty cut like range i didn't let me know if you want me to do a video on it called beauty collective let me know in the comments if you've used it before a divine diva matte lip kit which is a lip liner pencil and then a matte liquid lipstick so i will try that and let you know probably on insta stories how it goes I used this necklace on one of the people that I styled. I didn't wear it today because mustard on mustard is a lot of mustard. But I love this necklace as well. I think this is a tenner and I will doubtlessly be shoving this on probably with that black shirt um, quite a bit in the autumn. And then the last little bit I pick up when I do my running because I'm back at doing the 5 to K guys. I did a bit on holiday and it was so hard in the heat but I'm back. I'm back on it. Um... All of my running gear, ex with the exception of like my Britney Spears t-shirts, which I like to wear, is has been from Matland in the past, so I picked up some new. So I've got this. I will let you know how it goes, because obviously I've got the big badonkadonks, but I'll let you know how that one works out. And I know the leggings will be brilliant, so I just picked up these fancy leggings apart from they do show a bit of flesh for the side. I was gonna get like black black ones and grey ones and I saw these I thought you know what my legs deserve to be a bit snazzy so I walked those so there we go guys that is all my lovely 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 Matalan stuff I had such a lovely time whilst I was there Matalan is by far one of my mom uh my sister's and I's favorite brands so it's really really exciting thanks so much for your support which allows me to do such exciting kind of Things I would never, ever imagine that I would be dressing mannequins and then hanging out with Mark Wright and then, I don't know, just talking about the clothes I like. Um, I, I just, I just found it very overwhelming. So I love you lots. Make sure you subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Let me know below what videos you'd like coming up in the next few months and I will see you for another upload soon. Night guys. Mm -hmm.